Explosions on the second test flight caused SpaceX to lose contact with the Starship Mega Rocket. After explosions during its second test flight from South Texas, SpaceX lost communication with its massive rocket, Starship. Launched from the Elon Musk-owned company's launch facility in Boca Chica, the two-stage, 397-foot rocket, the biggest and most powerful ever built, arced out over the Gulf of Mexico after blasting off. The goal set by SpaceX was to reach a height of 150 miles, which would allow the spaceship to round the Earth and then, 90 minutes after launch, dive into the Pacific Ocean close to Hawaii. However, the extremely hefty first-stage booster burst shortly after it seemed to have separated. A short while later, a corporate announcer said that Mission Control had lost communication with the vehicle, while the main Starship spaceship continued into space. SpaceX's livestream host John Instrucker said, We have lost the data from the second stage. We think we may have lost the second stage. A video image following the core Starship booster appeared to show an explosion around 8 minutes into the test flight, indicating that the rocket had failed to achieve an altitude of 91 miles at that point. The company said in a post on the social media site X, formerly known as Twitter, with a test like this, success comes from what we learn. And today's test will help us improve Starship's reliability as SpaceX seeks to make life multiplanetary. Due to an unforeseen malfunction with the flight control gear, the launch that was supposed to happen on Friday was postponed by one day. After barely four minutes of its maiden flight in April, the Starship's wreckage crashed into the Gulf due to an explosion. Since then, SpaceX has upgraded the launch pad, the launcher, and all 33 of its engines several times. NASA needs the rocket to fulfill its goal of sending humans back to the moon. Additionally, Mr. Musk stated that Starship may be utilized for Mars expeditions.